Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. Stuart, your expectations? Yes, cheers, Derek. Well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters. These are the games that they dream of. No doubt in there, the underdogs. But if they can frustrate their opponents, stay in the game up until half-time, you just never know. Hopefully we get a great cup tie and maybe even a massive surprise. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4 5 1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And Spurs will go with this starting 11. Hugo Lloris begins in goal. Matt Doherty plays with Reggie Lon in the fullback positions. And the focal point in attack today, Harry Kane. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Useful looking position, you've got to say. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. And a Tottenham Hotspur free kick coming up. And Stuart, there's good reason to believe that Harry Kane's incisive presence could represent the difference today. Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes round the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. Kane. And it might be. And the pass getting in the way. Well, they've started really brightly here. They were so close to taking the lead. High quality defending. Can he play it in? Now a decent position. Rebier. And return to Kane. And it goes! The goal for 1-0. And that changes the dynamic. Well, here's the goal again. And it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Options in the middle. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Harry Kane. Now can they counter clinically?
Son. Opportunity. Oh, tremendous goal. Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here's the replay, and you just have to admire the patience of the passing as they look for that pivoting ball, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Well, a second goal for them here. Well, he's given us away. Bentancur. On the ball, Reguilon. Bentancur with it. Oh, moving it nicely. It's an opportunity. A goal! Another one! It's turning into an absolute demolition job. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, but look at the defenders. They lose their concentration, become sloppy with their marking, and as a result, they find the ball in the back of their net. Just not good enough. So far, you sense there could be extra punishment dished out. Into the advanced position. And strongly to win the ball. Well, nearing the half time interval, and suffice it to say, they're not making great use of home advantage. Stuart, your assessment? Well, what can you say? This has been a dismal first half display from them. They've lacked discipline, they've looked disorganised, and they've lacked fight. Not a great combination, really. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. And teammates to play it to. And a goal kick will be next. Well, truth be told, he's only had a very limited influence on this game, Stuart. Well, Derek, he's usually so clever around the edge of the box, but today he just hasn't shown that. As the touch map shows us, he hasn't had enough touches in those key areas. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, he's been excellent so far. Certainly the best player on the pitch. He scored a very good goal, and he's unlucky not to have a second when he hit the woodwork. Hopefully he shows us even more during the second half. And so this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Bentancourt. Giving the ball away. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And the pressure is on. Can he clear it away? 
Well, nothing comes of it. Romero. Matt Doherty. Javier. And Kane saw his pass intercepted. A real opening now. Was an important piece of defending. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Palmed away by the keeper. The concession of a corner here. Spurs to make a personnel switch now. Over it comes. A super tackle and they've won possession. Can they hit on the break? Kurusevsky. Doherty has it. Dejan Kurusevsky. Rebier. Matt Doherty. A fine block. Kane. Has eyes for goal. A goal! On this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, just look at this. He keeps his composure and he almost passes it into the back of the net. That's a very good goal. Substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. And as they restart the game, it's fair to say the gulf in quality between the two sides has been huge. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. He has time to play it over. And it's Winks. Rebier. Here's Kane. Can he finish? Thwarting him. Who's going to get on the end of it? And able to get a body in the way. Pressing as a team. Son. And no way through. Really good challenge. Well, cleared away, but at the expense of a corner. <laughs> 
Corner kick played in. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Well, that is how to run at defenders. And reading it absolutely superbly. Lucas. And Javier with it. Winks. Harry Kane. Javier. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Shielding the ball superbly. Javier. And there goes the final whistle. Well, they've got to make up for lost time now. A defeat at home on match day one, Stuart. Well, it's not the start they wanted. It puts them under a bit of pressure going into the next game. They need to bounce back now. Well, Son, you've got to say, scaling impressive heights and not for the first time. Stuart, he turned on the style yet again. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.